We are a contract manufacturer for the food and pharmaceutical industry. Um, we deal with dry powders and basically what happens is a um, large food or pharmaceutical company will come to us and say they either want some materials blended, grinded, repacked maybe. We also do some particle size analysis where we're doing some testing. The other thing is we do is uh, metal detection where we'll actually detect if there's any contamination in our customers' products and remove it for them. It started actually out with the FAST 5000, we got that, and we've seen the advantages of, of that, but there were some limitations as far as larger items and POs and tracking maintenance and whatnot. So we were looking for basically an all-inclusive um, solution, um, and then that's when FAST and all presented us with the FAST crib. First part is we use the issue order, which is how we vend items out of the FAST crib. It's very simple. You go and grab the items off the shelf, and we have a flip book with pictures and barcodes. You scan it. You put in the quantity that you took, you hit enter, and then you send the order, and then it automatically updates in the system the inventory level, and then also shows the min-maxes, um, and it'll create a deficiency report or, you know, reorder based on the min-max. The second way we use the Fast Crib system is to manage our suppliers. We have a total of 37 of them. Besides Fast and all the other 36 are either service-oriented or other consumables that we order. We're able to use the Fast Crib system to manage those suppliers by either creating POs directly with those other suppliers or creating what's called RFQs or requests for quotes. We can use the system to request quotes up to all 37 vendors at one time and be able to get those inputted back in. The last item that we use the Fast Crib for is to um, control our maintenance department. And by doing that, we're able to create work orders within the system that not only tracks um, who the maintenance operator is as it's performing it, how many hours he's performing, but also the true cost is what other replacement parts he's using on that particular asset. The advantage to it as well is that we're able to schedule these ahead of time so that the system knows that okay every six months um, Johnny needs to perform maintenance on asset B um, and then it also automatically sends him a reminder that okay you need to perform this and it gives him a bill of sale of everything that he needs to perform that function. Um, and then he's able to complete it, and I can see the complete audit trail from start to finish. Who, who started it, who's responsible, what they did, how much it cost, and then the date and time it, when it was completed. We recoup the cost that we initially spent on our fast crib within the first six months. Um, and a good example of that is, is that we, had, we have a lot of equipment that we're spending repairs on. We weren't able to see those hard dollars of what, you know, the history on what we were spending. So, with the fast crib, we were actually able to see that and realize that we should have probably replaced that piece of equipment long before. Um, and just the replacement of that one piece of equipment um, recouped the cost of the fast crib. It's been a huge time saver for us. And not only that, but like I've said, I have found more and more things that the software can do. Just when I think that I've mastered the software, I find something else that I wasn't quite utilizing to its full potential. Um, just the amount of traceability that I can have on every aspect not just ordering or um, vending items out of the fast crib, but you know it's the maintenance costs, it's the you know items of where we're placing those maintenance items. You know as far as assets, um, you know who's buying what, you know the control over that, um, you know the review of of uh, you know I can schedule calibrations with it. I can schedule even maintenance or cleaning items with the with the software. So you'd say it's a total solution for you? I would 100 percent.